what's up guys welcome back to another video in this video I will create simple to do application in Android studio I'm using here flutter and flutter is used for Android application and iOS application uh, welcome to my channel quarter blocks my name is Sefi and when you create your first when you create an empty project in the flutter so it create this default project which is simple basic counter app and you click on this it will simply increment the value at here so we will remove this uh, default uh, application and we will create simple to do app and using getx so first of all you have to go to this library file this pub spec.yaml and at here you have to go to this and write the get dot uh, get and semicolon and save so it will automatically download the get package in your project now it is downloaded so the first thing we have to do is to remove the default project right and when we remove it it will show us error so comment this error and first of all we have to create three folders number one is model because we are using getx and getx require a mvc design pattern because getx work on this design pattern model view controller and the other one is view where our front end code will be and the last one is controller and the controller is is to control these function specific functionality of our app right so first of all we have to define our data our model data so I will write here task dot dot and uh, I will write class task and I will define I will just add two attributes that will be task and the task created but when is that that when the task is created so these two attributes belong to my task class and this is the data now let's create a constructor for this this dot task then this dot uh, task created so all the error are gone and I defined my first data model for this application now let's go to controller and uh, in the controller package I will write counter sorry sorry I will write task controller dot dot right so I will define controller here and controller is about to control the task task controller I have to extend with get x controller and then it automatically import the library and at here I will define everything that would handle that would simply handle the task so it will handle the adding a new task and it will handle the deleting the current task if I want that and also it has a list to store the uh, number of tasks right so first of all first of all we have to define here list task list to save the task and import the library okay the dot obs is a special thing when you add this with any variable so it become observable right so basically this kind of thing is used in state management in flutter if you don't know about state management it is the same concept used in a react native but if you don't know just search it okay I will not explain right so that is used in the state management obvious when any changes happen 
so that changes will be reflected with the help of this OBS because it this variable is observable the, the changes will be detected on the front end that's it this is the purpose of dot OBS okay so we have defined our uh, task list so it will carry uh, list of task and now we have to define getter for it so for that simple waste task and then get and then task list so just remove just uh, rename this with the uh, underscore and then yeah so now the getter is set so we have one function is to add public uh, sorry wide a task will add the task and white delete task will delete the task right so add here I will write simple task if I want to make this is now dynamic if I want to give if I want to make it static so I will define its data type alright so currently I know the controller has these two responsibility to handle if there are other responsibility to handle so I will add data now let's come to the design part right first of all I will create here to do screen dot dot and st so it will show me two options state less budget and state full widget which will be i which i will be discussing in future so stay so get x package only works on stateless widget right you can't use stateful widget in get x this is the limitation now just import the library material library and now at here I will design my code so change container with scaffold come back to main and uncomment to solve this error so just make this uh, my home page to do screen and remove this title and between thing now I come back and it show me some error it is not an error it is a warning right which will be solved future in future first of all let's define body so in the body we have to define first safe area safe area is very important then child then center then tax okay one mistake child of center is tax and add here I will write no task found right and save it so I need to make it constant Okay, I'm sorry. Only scaffold should be constant and the remaining should be simple. It is. Okay, now if I rerun the application, so I simply see small text view in the center which is no task which is no task found. So I have to little design this text and I have to remove this debug in the top right corner for that let's go to main and let's remove this uh, theme and title also and uh, yeah let's make it get material app not material app get material app because I am using get package now what is the warning I don't know but now let's uh, add show debug show checked mod banner should be 
false okay Okay, the warning is gone, right? Now let's come back to our design and let's uh, add here. I will uh, define the variable of text team with the name of text and then team team dot off dot uh, text team. That's it. Add here. I will style this text text dot headline 5 with color of color is ok invalid constant value if I remove this the error is gone right so now let's rerun the program now it's look nice so now add here I have to add a button to add a task for that I will do I will go to add the scaffold and I will write floating action button and I will define it container I want to define the button should be add here I will write container and I am uh, adding a button as circular and uh, circular button so for that I will use container then decoration box decoration then uh, border radius should be border radius circular because the button should be circular on 50 it will be completely circle circular it will be completely show as circle then comma then uh, what should be the color of the button that will, will be red and that's it and the child will be its icon yeah icon and inside the icon I have to and the color of the icon should be white color dot white still this is showing me warning let's make it constant the warning is gone right so now let's rerun the program and see if this is so small so I have to make it bigger for that I will go to the container let's make its width 50 and height 50 and then go again and now it is good so we have to wrap this container with the ink well to do that uh, wrap with the widget it will be ink well and this will give me a on tap function when user will tap will click on this button with, with this container so it will do some specific action right boss right 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 so with that I need to move to the new screen where I have to 